Okay, um, so today I'm gonna teach you uh, how to find a record and remove it. So to do that, um, you first need to create the base, right? And you need to require the Mongo's library, then the library you need, in my case, is this. Um, then you connect to your Mongo's library. After you do that, you need to create your scheme. Once you got the scheme, you create your model. And in this case, for this as an example, I am gonna create a new record um, with the name to be removed and sample data. Then, after I create it, I'm gonna lock that record that I created so I can remove it later, right? So, <clears throat> removing the record, the record will be passed to the callback. The remove record will be passed to the callback, right? So I'm gonna use this this method, find one and remove from the model. This is a method from the model, and it will take the in the first argument the conditions, and in the second argument the callback. So in the conditions, I'm gonna put that remove the record that it's named like to be removing so it will find the first match of the record no the the first record that match this name and it will remove it then in the callback if there is an error i will lock the error and if not we will have the record the remove record in the data argument so i do i lock this the document with the id um, and then the data id was removed and it will tell me what was the id of the removal record so with that in mind let's see how it works no in the subject yes it connect to the database it creates the record you see uh, the name to be removed and it creates a new ID and after that it tells me oh the document with ID this ID was removed and that's how we work this method uh, bye bye